The topology shown as this picture. Make sure that router A has internet connection. Make a note of the Wi-Fi name and password of the router A to which the router B will connect it. Generally, you don't need to configure the router A. You only need to configure the router B. Step 1. Connect to the router B. Firstly, power on the router. Secondary, connect one of the LAN ports of router to computer via cable. Power on the router. Find the router's default SSID and connect to it. Type the default Wi-Fi password. Click OK. Step 2. Configure the router B. Open the browser on your computer. Type www.tenderwifi.com in address bar and then press enter. Click start and configure the router step by step. Click skip. Select your country. Change your Wi-Fi name as you want. Change your Wi-Fi password as you want. The Wi-Fi password should be A to 32 characters. If you want to set up the login password to the same as the Wi-Fi password, Please check here. You can also customize a password for login password. Login password should be 5 to 32 characters. And then click next. Enter the login password you have set just now and then click login. Click wireless settings, then choose wireless repeating. Enable wireless repeating. Choose universal repeater. Click Please Select. Find and click the Wi-Fi name of the uplink router. Type the Wi-Fi password of the uplink motor. Click Save. Click OK. Click OK. The router will be boot automatically. Please wait a minute. Login the setting page again. Type login password and then click login. Check the connection status. If it displays bridge successfully in 
universal repeater mode. That means the bridge is successful.